Level 17, Medieval Mystery Zone. This is the Ever Crystal Maze level. I love castle tile set levels. I really do. And we have a time limit, so I better be on the lookout for that. Hmm. Oh no, are you... Are you for real? <laughs> Why is that one slightly... Oh, it's because to account for that gap. Alright. True phys I love true physics mode. It is... All the bad it's brought is far outweighed by the good it's brought. <laughs> well... Wait a second. Can I climb up past that? I'm probably not supposed to be able to, but I bet I can. Well, we can lose free lemmings. Walker's one of them. I think that's too high up for one. Yeah, that's too high up for one builder. So then all we have to do is place a blocker up here. They turn around. Now we can use our remaining digger and then mine through there. Pick up the floater for some reason. Not sure why we're going to need the floater. Do I actually have to climb through that? Interesting. Alright, first off, I'm going to see if I can climb through that. Because obviously I get burned through there, but what about down here? No. Well, well. Well, I'm not going to be able to find out, I get re just realized, because I am running out of builders. But I definitely have to use two builders to get up there. No two ways about that. And clearly I will have to use a builder. So no, I think I've used the builders in the right place. Well... I guess that really only means one thing. One, two, three, four, five... Actually... There you go. You are now the proud owner of a glider. I still, or not a glider, a floater. I still don't know what that's going to be used for, though. need to save a blocker somewhere, because I'm just guessing what I have to do is climb, bomb, bash, build, block with the same builder, get up there. Well, maybe not with the same builder. Okay, where can I save? Okay.
Oh. I can save a blocker at the beginning. So just to make sure, I'm going to need Miner there. Miner there. And a single Miner there. Yeah, cool! Well, provided nothing unseemly happens here... Still don't know what the floater's for. Yeah, provided nothing, like, unseemly that I'm not expecting happens here. This is level complete. One, two, three, four, five, six. And the minor tunnel's even dug in such a way that the climber won't escape. Just mine through here and build to the exit. Oh, time's up. That's gonna be it. Okay. Forgot about that. Hmm. Alright. So just gotta do everything as fast as possible then. That's part of it. We've got to build up. Well, that won't affect the climber, though. Alright. This will work. Now I can have this guy dig the hole, and he will get started on this part of the stage. See, Flopsy, time limits are very useful. One, two, three, four, five, six. Now we gotta hurry up for this guy. Now you climb up. Oh, that look! Look, that worked out perfectly. I'll send him a bit earlier just to make sure. I don't need to put the walker so yeah high up. Lovely. Again, not sure what the floater is used for. But I still have three minutes left, so I'm making pretty good time. 
I already see this guy is going to be our problem. He's gonna climb up and do go all around. And I don't think he's gonna make it back in time. Oh! Maybe he will! Oh great! That was a lovely level! I have absolutely no idea why there is a floater on that level, let alone as a pickup skill. So you can just probably remove the floaters altogether, Flopsy, and you've got a very nice level. Level 18! Dark Dark Side Lemmings. <laughs> What's with the yellow background over there? It's like day and night. Interesting. It's not every day I get to a shadow level, which is interesting. And we've got a stoner pickup skill. That is understandable, because stoners are pretty powerful. Floaters, not so much. Alright, let's work backwards. Clearly, we've got someone to climb up. I can bash for the roof. Pick up the stoner. There can be someone right behind them. I like the idea of the day-night uh, level. It's actually pretty cool. No swimmer. That's weird. So we're gonna clearly we're gonna have to climb, bomb, bash over the top. Don't turn around, bash, build up there, stone in the gap, or stack. Okay. And we have a time limit for this one, too. Cool. Rather precise time limit. Alright, so we gotta work fast. Which is good, because you do need to go fast in lemmings sometimes. Alright, stoner. Stone from right there. We're gonna need someone to turn around and bash for that pretty quickly. Oh, we also have a digger. How did I not see that? We have three diggers. Okay, this just got a bit more interesting. We only have a few builders, so we're going to need two to get across there and one to get up there. So that's for all three of our builders down. Then that means we're going to need stoner there. Put the stacker somewhere. It's going to be hard putting the stacker in a place where the climbers are going to get interfered by it. We'll figure something out. Okay, so someone's digging at the very edge, clearly.
because if he digs at the very, very edge, he will pick up the stoner. Okay. We're gonna bash for as little as necessary. So what I want to do... Actually, hang on. So what I want to do is bash through, yeah, just enough so that there's a roof. Climb at such a point that he turns around or pretty much right there, digs, and then bashes. Maybe when he reaches the... right before the clock, I'll send someone up. Perfect. Just like that. Climbers. I'm gonna send two because one of them is just gonna dig through there. That splat height, though, that's a problem. Maybe we'll just send one. We need him digging that pillar as soon as possible. Because it's quite a big job. Yeah, so this one, it's not so much how to do the level, it's more how to do it as efficiently and quickly as possible. Come. That's not good. That is much sooner than we need them to come. We can afford to kill quite a few. We're killing two stoners and a blocker and a bomber, but we can afford to kill two more. And I think that's exactly what I'm going to do. I think I'm going to kill this guy. So that way, the, these, this crowd is still held back for a bit. Now we're going to send another one. 
Hey, where do we use all our diggers? We have three of them. Oh yeah, I use all three. That's right. Okay. At least I know where to do use everything. Because we need the stoner there. We're gonna need another stoner over there. I think. Because the stacker, I feel like, is going to take too long. So we've got the right idea. Climb up, bash, dig at the very edge. Okay, so we got our two guys. They're gonna dig from there. Now my goal is to get that guy to dig slightly lower down than this guy. So that way I can use a stacker to turn a guy around. And now we're going to need a stoner to break the fall. Well... Yeah, still need to break the Falcon work. In which case, we need all three diggers over here. One for the very edge, one to dig and provide a turnaround point, and then the other to actually dig down low enough, or high enough, that you can bash. Or I suppose what I could do, I could dig down, build, hit my head, turn around, climb up, dig, and then bash. But that might take too long. But it could be worth a try. Yeah, I think this is going to waste too much time. Hmm. Okay, how many bashers do we need? We need one to get for the one to get for the top, one to get through at the bottom. One to get up above there, one to get through there. So we have one basher with which we can do what we want. Like, cancel a digger or something. 
Maybe this is where we're gonna need the stacker. That was the right one. Yes, it was. Cool. Actually really clever, because now they're all lumped together, which is amazing. Exactly what we need. Now we've got like next to no time left. Uh oh, I see the problem. We do need that extra basher to get Yeah, now we need the extra basher to get past the stoner. And they would have made it too, rats. Maybe it's just all a matter of when to start digging the middle column out. matter of splat height, unfortunately. Uh, if only there was somewhere to turn the guy around, like... Pixel. One blinking pixel. And I got that as perfect as possible. I 
tree rate? Yes, there is. How do I get this guy to cancel out? Because we still need the two bashers. We still need all three bashers left. And I kind of want to use the stacker to hold them back. Well, you know what? We're going to buy us as much time as we possibly can. You are going to literally dig as low down as you possibly can. You are going to build from right there. No, stacker's not going to actually work in that regard. What if we did use a stacker at the end and then... That's not splat height either. How oh, lovely. Climber is not necessary. Hope this works out. Oh, I this is not going to work out, I don't think. Actually, it might. It's all going to be about the time. So that'll hold them back. What do you mean I can't stack there? Mm, it's going to be a tight one. So he's going to splat. Oh, it worked! It worked! Holy cow! That was an intense level. That's a good example of time limits done right. Well done, Flopsy! I love that one. And unless I'm mistaken, I think we only have two murder levels left, which we'll have to wait till the next video. Thank you so much for watching. I am Colorful Artie. Tune in then, and you should be in for a nice little treat, hopefully. Have a great day, and God bless. Thank you.